from the station working for you. This is a WRTV update. And I'm Lauren Casey. Here's the latest from the WRTV newsroom. Metro police are looking for a driver in a deadly hit and run crash on the city's west side. Police say the driver hit a man walking on West Washington Street at Biltmore Avenue. That's directly in front of the Wayne Township Fire Station number 82. The man died from his injuries at the hospital. Investigators say that they believe surveillance video will help them determine the driver involved in this crash. A state fire marshal has identified two men killed in a mobile home fire out in Franklin County earlier this month. The fire started just before 2 o'clock in the morning on, in Brookville on December 9th. Police say 56-year-old David Estridge and 50-year-old Ron Emery died in that fire. After the fire was out, investigators learned the home's only heat source was a wood stove. Investigators don't think any criminal activity is connected to the fire. The coronavirus pandemic continues to have a severe impact on the Hoosier state, so let's take a look at the latest numbers. On Sunday, the state health department reported nearly 6,600 new cases of the coronavirus. Health officials also report 53 more Hoosiers have died with the virus. An average of 65 Hoosiers have died with the virus each day this month. The state's seven-day positivity rate is falling, though. It's now standing at 12.2%. Time now for a check of our Monday forecast with meteorologist Alyssa Donovan. Hey, Alyssa. Hey, Lauren. It is going to be a pretty mild day. Those temperatures in the 40s by this afternoon. We are going to see a possibility of a midday shower, seeing some of those around our northern counties this morning. Breezy winds as well. Those gusts close to 30 miles per hour. Looking at our Christmas Eve forecast, 37 with some chance of snow 24 on Christmas Day and much chillier temperatures continuing to climb through Wednesday before we drop off just in time for the holiday. Alyssa, thank you. You can find the latest forecasts and all of our stories anytime on the WRTV mobile app. Have a good one.